So in this quick video, I'm gonna show you how to set up MCP servers for WinServe, for Client, and for RootCode. Let's go. Today, we're gonna to just set up the usual Brave, Puppeteer, and we could even do Tavili. I'm not gonna go over the differences between Client and RootCode. It's just a fork of Client with some extra features that I actually prefer over Client, but Client is still great. WinSurf just got MCP support and I still find it to be a bit buggy, but I'm gonna show you how to set it up because it should be the same even after they fix the bugs. So here we're in the official model call and text protocol servers. At the top we have the reference servers, then we have a third party servers, and then down below we have community servers. And there's plenty of other websites and tools where you could find even more community made servers. So we're just gonna do Brave. If you haven't set up the Brave API yet, you get 2000 queries per month for free. So I'd suggest setting that up. I'll put a link in the description. Assuming you already did that, let's just go forward. We set up with MPX. And by the way, this tutorial, as always, is only for Mac. So what we're gonna do is copy from here to here copy it, and of course get your API key. Now let's open up VS Code. The first step is if you're in VS Code, you're using Klein or Rue Code. Now you could download either of them if you don't have them within the extensions tab. Here's the Klein icon. You click here to MCP servers, that's where we're at. And you see I already have it all set up. You just click configure MCP servers, and just like in Cloud Desktop, you have the whole JSON setup. So what we're gonna do first is just paste in Brave, paste it in here and put in your API key you got from Brave API. If you're adding more servers, same thing. You just add a comma and you add another server. So I took the Puppeteer server, also MPX, and I also set up the Tavili server, also MPX. Don't worry, I'm gonna delete my API keys for all of this, just wanna show you here. Command S, save and you see updating MCB servers, MCB servers updated, that's it, it works. Now RuCode, same thing, and so much of the same thing, check this out. If you click the MCB servers tab, so let's close this down. So now MCB servers, this is RuCode, if you click Edit MCP settings. It's literally called client MCP. So this isn't root code. They copied it exactly. So anyway, same thing. Just copy and paste all your servers in, starting with MCP servers. If you add multiple servers, don't forget to add a comma between them. And don't forget to add your API keys. Very straightforward. Command S, save it, and that's it. Okay, lastly, we're gonna do WinSurf. Okay, WinSurf is another VS Code fork, another cursor competitor, a lot of the same, but done differently. I prefer cursor but WinSurf is still great, Cascade is awesome. So to add MCP servers in WinSurf, you just do it in the Cascade. So you see here, you have three things, and we're just gonna click the tools icon, zero MCP servers available, and all you gotta do is press configure. It opens up another MCP config JSON. So they give you an example here of GitHub. Okay, so in this case, we're gonna set up from scratch because there's nothing else here. So let's just go back to Brave Search. So in this case, we're gonna copy everything. Let's go like this, copy the whole thing, paste it in here, and boom. Okay, of course, if you wanna add more servers, you just go to here, add a comma here, and you add another server. So let's say we wanted to go to Puppeteer. We just go down Puppeteer, Open it up, go to the MPX. Now we don't need this because we already have it. So we just go from here to here, copy it, paste it, boom, done. We press refresh and we see the two tools here. Now, here's what I mean. WinSurf is a bit buggy. Brave Search shouldn't work right now because there's no API key in there. So anyways, don't forget to add your API key. I'm sure WinSurf is gonna add more support for MCP soon. The reason I don't suggest using MCP servers yet with WinSurf is because it's a bit buggy. I added these servers before and then my WinSurf just stopped working. So I deleted them, but I'm sure even probably by the time this video comes out, it won't be a problem anymore. So that's the quick way to add MCB servers to Klein, RuCode, and WinSurf. I've covered all these MCB servers in detail in other videos. So I'll put a link to my MCP playlist somewhere on the screen. And those videos are going into detail on how I use each MCP server. I even have tips on how to update them. If you have any feedback or questions, drop in the comments below. If you found this video helpful, don't forget to give it a like. And if you haven't done so already, please subscribe to my channel. It really helps me grow. Thank you for watching and have a great day.